Hello, I'm William. And I'm Nicholas. We're doing another review for WilliamReviews.com. Right, so, what is this model called? This model is called Droid Escape. And what's its number? It is number 9490. And how many pieces? It's got a hundred and... 37 pieces. Wow, that's a lot for this size model. So, well, first let's go over the minifigures, like always. Yep. Uh, let's go over R2, because I'm going to do a comparison. So here's a new R2. He's got loads of detail. And here's my old R2 from the LEGO Anakin's Y-Wing 2009. Look at the detail on both of them. It's way more detailed on this one, isn't it? Yeah, so... New R2 is, is more detailed than the old one. Now, see, so 3 is going to jump in the screen. It's new. There. And 3 this is a new version of C-3PO. He's more detailed than the old one as it's well. It's got wires in his chest where there used to be nothing. Which makes it a really interesting character. Next, let's go for the Sand Troopers. This that is guy. a Sand Trooper. He's got a white Liam Put arch, which is what Minifig Maker calls um, calls a shoulder cape. He's got a little detonator in one hand and a standard blaster in the other. He looks quite impressive. He's got a normal Stormtrooper helmet, except if you look really carefully, or if you get this set, you'll notice it is, isn't, because he's got loads of little sandy bits. He's got an interesting torso. He has, he has got a printed back. Um, on the back, it has a really nice back torso, but it has a backpack. It also has printed legs. He also has printed legs. He looks really good. He's got the new black helmet with a face. Black head with a face. And But I think he's just a normal sand trooper. Uh, here's the other sand trooper. He's got a rifle. An orange shoulder cape. And the same backpack. He's got the same helmet, body and legs, and the same backpack. I think he looks really cool, but I think this guy is the leader of the Sand Troopers. And because he gets the honour of riding this bike. And let's go over the bike now. It looks pretty simple, but it was quite tricky to make because you had to get everything just right or else either it would tip too, uh, too much forwards or it would just push the sand trooper off the back. I still didn't manage to get this, storm this sand trooper on the back. It still looks really good. It's just like the classic ones in the movie, um, episode 5, A New Hope. No, not episode, not New Hope, The Empire Strikes Back. I mean, episode 4, A New Hope. It looks really good. But, let's go over the pod now. Nicholas? I'll just take these two droids out. I've been seeing how they fit in. Now, put this on. Here it is. Looks very stable, don't you think? It can stand here, but since it's a pod, it just seems pointless. Well, this is the pod. It can stand up like this. It seems pointless you because you can escape it's pod. Because it's an escape pod, yeah. Also, look at this. So, if Mick's flying it, like this, he's got no danger of it falling apart. When he lands it, like that, 
still no danger if he keeps his hand there. If he takes his hand off and flies it again, that bit comes off. So it's perfect for acting out crashes with your Lego collection. Yeah. Also, it's this got room well. for R2-D2 and C-3PO. And it seems pretty interesting how Lego made this. Because they've used these really big bits here. They've used really big bits here as the pod walls and they put a sticker on um it looks really interesting how they got to make this piece looks like they could have used it for a forge or something like that and as nick has demonstrated just now it does fit r2 and 3po in like that Here's the crash. This stand trooper has seen something. <laughs> hey, what was that over there? I better come to a bus. <laughs> Looks like it's an escape pod from a Star Destroyer. Hmm. What's in it? We'll soon see. Now let's see. But a few minutes later. Um, a few minutes earlier, C-3PO and R2-D2 had gotten out and ra and just gone as fast as they could over to Moss Eisley Cantina, where they re-met with Luke. So, will the sand troopers find them in the cantina, or, or will, will they, they get fail? away? Or will the two droids get away? And you can decide if you buy it. See ya. <laughs> what rating do you give it? I'd give it a 10 out of 10. Cool, 10.